I think from an early childhood perspective, also about the metaphor of teaching your kid to swim, because that takes years. And you kind of start out with a bit more monitoring, more hands-on, more teaching, and eventually kids become more independent. But at the same time, if you live near a lake or an ocean, you know the waters are changing constantly too. So you may have to have more monitoring or more specific skills that you're teaching at some time when the waters are rough. And I think back to your point about wanting to keep things open so kids will come to us, because media right now is not the same thing as you have a TV in your living room and you're all sitting around watching it and you kind of know what your kid's seeing. With handheld devices and really personalized feeds and ads, kids may be seeing things that you just, as a parent, you can't monitor everything. And so we really want to keep the lines of communication open so that kids can trust that they can come to us. We're not going to freak out or overreact. We're not going to take everything away and shut it down, but that we're here to listen if there is something like someone being mean online, seeing some creepy content, not being sure what to do, you know, if they're not having as good of a time on their social platform as they had hoped. Mm -hmm.